Oh, what's up, everybody? Dude, I almost walked tonight. I literally almost walked my off my job tonight. I don't know if I'm going to make this into a video. If I do, I do. I don't, I don't. But I'll definitely highlight it. <clears throat> for sure. And the situation was stupid to begin with. So, what happened was, it got busy. Or actually, I've been busting my ass... Just about the whole time I was there, and I uh, go on break for a little bit, and then we got more shit, and I had dishes every fucking where. I had dishes on a broil cart, I had dishes on in the back, and I had a lot up by me. And I decided, you know what? I'm gonna ask the kitchen manager to help me. So I yelled out his name and said, such and such his name, so he could hear me. So you can hear me. Hey, when you're not busy, can you come over and help me? And I kind of said it loud enough to where he could hear me. As he got over here, I was slamming shit down because I was pissed off. Right? And he's like, oh, you're going to slam shit down. Then I'm not going to help you. And I told him, you know what? Then don't fucking help me. And then after he helped me, he comes up to me and says, look, I don't like what how you approached asked help. For help. You could have walked out to me and asked for help. Bitch, we were busy. How am I going to stop what I'm doing and walk up to you where you're at and ask for your help? When it's easier for me to say I need help. And he, you taught it like it was a damn fucking... Like, dude, we're not in school anymore. This is real life shit. Okay? Real life shit. Okay? I'm going to use my fucking voice that God gave us to use and say your name and ask for your help when you're not busy. And I left to where you could hear me because I had a dish tank going. That's loud. I had my music kind of going, so that's kind of loud as well. And he got pissed off because he didn't like the way I asked him for help. Newsflash, bro. Not everybody's going to come up to you and ask for help. And then he's come back next time. Walk up to me and ask for help. I'll be like, you know what? I go get a different job. I'll go work somewhere else. I don't need your shit. I asked for your help. No other manager would not have gotten pissed off but you. Because I asked the, the closing manager before I left, would you got mad if I called out your name and asked for help loud enough to where you could have heard me from a dish tank? She said no. Point taken. He was pissed because I asked for help and he didn't want to help me. Then me and him got into it. I said, well, you know what? I won't ask for your help anymore. I'm done asking for your help. Don't need it. If I'm that much of a burden to ask for your help, then I am not going to ask for it no more. I'll figure it out. I've done that shit by myself when it was a lot fucking harder than it is now. There's been some nights I didn't get out of the damn job till 2.30 in the morning. 2 o'clock in the morning. 1.30 in the morning. Like, all it boils down to is just a fucking, I don't know what to call them. But that kind of pissed me off to where I almost walked out tonight. Like, fuck, dude. You help everybody else on the fucking cook line. You rotate everybody out on the cook line, but you don't rot you don't fucking watch my dish tank while I go on fucking break. I have to guess to go, and then if it piles up, it piles up. That 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 right there is a fucking I don't know. 
He pissed me off. I, I'm going to let him know he pissed me off, dude. I let him know he pissed me off. Like, if you're going to be like that, then why the fuck did I ask for your help? <laughs> I'm not going to walk up to you and ask you to help me when I got a voice that I could use and fucking project it to where you can hear me, you know, fucking busier than fuck. I'm running around with my head cut off. Asked you for help, and you basically gave me the cold shoulder. You you did help me, he did help me, but at the like after the fact, I hated that confrontation. He knew I was pissed. He knew it. He was just seeing how far he could go with it, because I I damn near I, I did, did this fucking close, this close of walking out of there. That fucking close. And one of these days, it's going to fucking happen where I'm going to walk off the fucking job and not come back. So, I've come up with some tips for myself. I'm not going to ask him for help anymore because he's going to give me a cold fucking shoulder. We're done asking for help for him. And if he wants to help and he sees me fucking struggling, okay, I'll let him help, but I'm not going to ask for it no more because I'm tired of getting yelled at. I'm tired of it. I'm sick and tired of it. This other cook, me and him got into it. He apologized. I'm not going to apologize for what I did. I don't feel like I was wrong. If you if you think I was wrong, let me know in the comment section. Was I in the wrong here for using my voice to project my voice and he was over by the fry side area I'm not going to sit there and fucking go walk and fucking walk back. I do that enough throughout the day as it is. He was just pissed that I had to, he had to help me for a little bit. But anyways, that's going to do it for the video. I don't know if I want to post it or not, but that that's going to do it for this video. If you guys enjoyed it, give it a like. If I was in the wrong, let me know in the comment section. I would love to hear your opinions on this whole thing because I was so close to just saying fuck that job and fucking went home. This was like fucking what? A little before 8 o'clock at night. One of these days, man... Someone's going to piss me off to the point where I'm just going to say, fuck this job. I'll go work a third shift job. And if that happens, we'll have morning streams a lot more. But anyways, that's going to do it for this video. Check out all the cool links down below in the description. Subscribe if you're new. Follow if you're new. And so sorry, peace out until next time. Have a great day. I don't know if I'm going to upload that as a video, but I had to get that off my chest. Because that was kind of bullshit of what was. <laughs> that she's like, oh, you shouldn't have talked to me this way, bitch. This is not fucking school no more, bro. We're fucking adults trying to make ends meet, bro. Like, if it was that much of a hassle for you to come over, you know, to help me out, then I would have never fucking asked for help. Let's fucking be real, man. And I rarely ask for help. It's just, it's getting, it's getting closer to Christmas, and that's why it's been kind of busy these last couple days. You know, it's just, it just, it, it, he just, he just hit a nerve, man. He, oh my God. He struck a nerve to where I almost wanted to go off on him. I should have probably went off on him, but but I know better. I fucking know better, you know. So